Testing, testing.
Ladies and gentlemen, another wonderful evening here ahead of us from Canlan Ice Arena in West Dundee, Illinois. Alex Tatum with you and the NIU Huskies. Welcome to all who are tuning in with us on this beautiful Friday evening we have here. Warmed back up a little bit. We had a couple of cold days in a row there. But tonight you are tuning in here to watch the NIU Huskies play the McKendree Bearcats. So thank you for all who are tuning in with us on this Friday evening. Tonight, the NIU bench is being, li being led by head coach Brad Stofers, assistant coach Wayne Bauer, assistant coach Jeremy Bauer, and last but not least, assistant coach Zach Bishop. And for the Bearcats over there, we got head coach Gary Henson, also being led by assistant coach Tommy Brown and another assistant coach, Kyle O'Kane. So we're welcoming in the Bearcats from Lebanon, Illinois. Not too bad of a drive compared to some of the teams we play here in the Northwest Chicago area. Tonight, for your McKendree Bearcat starting lineup. Sitting between the pipes, we got Dillian Daliar. We are number 31, playing goalie backing up. McKendree Bearcats here tonight. At defense, we have number 61, Blake Martin, and number 77, Connor Mullins. Last but not least, we got wings Joe McCormick, we're at number 23. Kyle McCung, we're at number 39. And last but not least, center, number 49, Mattis Alexandrov. And now for your NIU Husky starting lineup. Standing between the pipes, we got number 75, Ben Vucci. And sitting right in front of him for defense, we have Keaton Peters wearing number 24, and Rodon Evans wearing number 23, and pulling back on defense as he's been doing the past couple weeks here. So in the wing pair for tonight, starting off, are Hunter Wall wearing number nine, and Randy After wearing number 43, and last but not least, taking the center, taking the face off at center ice, we have Nick Gonzalez here to hopefully win the face off for the Huskies. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to take a quick moment of silence for the national anthem. Ladies and gentlemen, again, we are here the, watching the NIU Huskies play the McKendree Bearcats. Again, thank you for all who are tuning in. And tonight, quick shout out from the chat there. We have Evan's family tuning in from all from Alaska, Tennessee, Wisconsin, and Massachusetts. Thank you all for tuning in and welcome in. Hopefully we get a Husky win tonight. We're kind of needing for one. All the guys seem to be in a good mood. Game ready here, walking in today, talking to a couple of them. They are ready to buckle down and play some hockey. After good weeks of practice, we're gonna see the skates hit the ice here for the Huskies, facing off against the Bearcats. Again, sitting here facing off, we have Gonzalez for the skis. Hopefully he can win it back and get a good start to the game. We 
We got the ref dropping the puck. Bearcats come out on top with the faceoff, and the first period is underway. Bearcats still in possession, 61 over to 77, back to 61 for the Bearcats. A little bit of back and forth between the two D here, and the Bearcats are able to get it into the Husky zone. Evans picks it up behind the net, passes it behind his back over to after. Turns it over back into Bearcats possession. Again, a little bit of back and forth here. Huskies come out on top, nice pass over to after in the neutral zone, skiing it into the ice into the Bearcats zone for a quick turnaround. Bearcats coming out on top with possession. Quick step up there by Pathana, summoned it deep into the Bearcats zone. No ice in here, ice and called off. Ref did have his hand in the air. That's what it seems like one of the Bearcats must have touched it. And again, had a nice rush there by Pathana. Not letting the Bearcats get a stick on it. And again, a great hit there, really fighting for the puck, fighting behind the net. And a rejected shot there. Pathana skating up. And getting it deep into the Bearcat zone. Clement putting some nice pressure there in the corner, hitting number 22, knocking him off his feet. A lot of back and forth here. Neither team can really settle it down too well. But Huskies come out on top. Nice pass up to the D for Zondek. Holding the puck, looking for that open shot. And a nice redirect there by Bearcats, number eight. Got a little back and forth, Bearcats game, possession go off the glass. Well, only had a nice tip out of the air. And it seems we got a high sticking whistle. Again, tonight you got Alex Tatum behind the mic and Sean Cerny behind the camera. Thank you guys for tuning in here with us. And the faceoff's gonna be back down in the Huskies zone with Matt Martin taking the faceoff for the Huskies. And number 29 for the Bearcats taken there. Huskies come out on top of a nice skate through there by Peters, getting it back down to the corner. Evans holds it in the corner, takes it right back behind the net, giving his team a little bit of time. Nice pass up there to Peters. Peters going off the boards over to Gieske. Gieske right back to Martin, tries to put it in the zone. Bearcats put it right back on a stick and carry it into the Husky zone. Nice stop there by Martin, nice intercept to the pass, not letting him get that shot off. Martin carries it in to the Bearcat zone, goes for a quick shot, and a nice save there by the goalie. First shot so far this game for the Huskies. We'll see a nice attempted keep in there by Gieske, knocking it over the glass and out of play. Got just 17.38 here remaining on the clock. Still zero to zero. Huskies came out flying today. They are come out ready to play. And it looks like they've got a couple of nice passes there right off the bat. Must have been working on their breakout during practice this week. And again, we got the Huskies facing off down here in the Bearcat zone. The ref drops the puck, and Huskies get it into the corner. Bobcats shoot it high and hard over everyone's head, 17. Goes for a backdoor pass. Barely missing, number three stick. Quick two shots on net there, and a nice save and cover by Vucci. Again, okay, we saw a two on one there. It's an attempted backdoor pass, luckily pass, and it's just a foot too far in front of him, making it incomplete. We had Karsten Portel taking the face off here against Gonzalez, Nick Gonzalez. A nice pass off the glass there. Unfortunately, going all the way down into the Bearcat zone, causing a icing whistle. Causing the play to be right back down into the Huskies zone. Again, Gonzalez here taking the face off against Carson Portel for the Bearcats. The refs talking through. Oh, he's get a change of pace here. Actually, the puck's being dropped at center ice after a bit of disagreement. Seems to be an accidental whistle there. Rule of hockey is if there's an icing, but the team who iced it beats it, all the other players into the zone, then the icing is called off. Seems to be mis going to misunderstanding there. But luckily, the refs caught themselves making a mistake and put it at center ice. Number three for Bearcats, get a quick dump in. Dusky zone, Marks picks it up behind the net, passing over to after. After holding it on the boards, putting it off the boards, getting it out of the Husky zone. 
Bearcats pass to each other and get it back deep in the Husky zone. Or Marks chipping it up the boards to Gonzalez. Gonzalez goes for an attempt to pass out of the zone with Portel intercepting. Portel goes for a quick shot and a nice back check there by Porzonda getting right in front of him, hitting him, knocking him off his feet before he's able to get a shot off. Quick shot there on net, nice save by Vucci. Two saves by Vucci, three. And the Huskies get it out of the slot and it's still a zero to zero game. Gonzalez comes out on top, getting it out of the Husky zone, getting it across the red line, goes for an attempted dump. Had a nice redirect there by number three for Bearcats, putting him right back in possession. Number 55 picks it up behind the net, carrying it around, skating as going for a skate through neutralize. Nice intercept there by Clement. Giving it over to Wall, who got it up to Pathana, getting it back deep in the Bearcats zone. Puck takes a weird bounce. Evans is able to settle it and get it back deep. But again, Bearcats begin their breakout, getting into the Husky zone. Nice stop there by Peters. Not let him get a shot off. 49 goes for an attempt to pass across ice. Bearcats keeping it in after a missed pass. We see a missed shot there. Clement coming in, not letting the D Bearcats defense get it. And a nice dodge there by Walney. Not going without the hit. Nice sauce pass in front. Barely missing the open net. Walney puts it right again, right on net. Martin picks it up. Martin up to Evans for a quick attempted one-timer. Unfortunately, missing the net to the left. Letting Bearcats break it out. Bearcats bringing it in the Husky zone. Evans putting the pressure there in the corner, causing Huskies to be back in possession. Martin carries it up over the red line and into the Bearcats zone. With a nice shot there. And an almost goal, and a nice two saves by the goalie. Goalie left the rebound after a quick shot, letting an empty puck sitting right in front of the net, but luckily he was able to get that second save, keeping this a zero to zero game. And we saw a really nice setup there by Walney carrying it in the zone earlier as well. Huskies are coming out firing today. Looking good, feeling good, and hopefully we can capitalize on that. A nice skate across there by Anderson, knocking it off the Bearcats' stick. Rizuko puts it up the boards. Bearcats pick it up, go for a quick shot, and a nice block there by Anderson. Vucci steps up, is able to ice the puck out of the zone after it goes in the slot with a quick whistle and another stoppage of play. Again, it's going to be causing the Huskies to be facing off down back in the Husky zone, but you gotta do that every once in a while. Give the guys some breather on the ice, let them reset up, and start fresh. We got Martin here taking the face off against Alex Kent. Bearcats coming out on top. Bearcats coming back deep into the Husky zone with 77 picking it up, putting it back, back behind the net. Pass, quick pass from the corner up to the slot, luckily with no shot coming out of it. Again, Martin tries to go off the glass, taking it in the net above the glass, causing another quick out of play whistle. If you guys are here or near, I encourage you to come out tomorrow. We got the Husky, or Skate with the Huskies, tomorrow after the game. So come rent a pair of skates and encourage you guys to come on out and join the team. We had After with a nice kick out there, Wall putting pressure, gonna get down deep into the Bearcats zone. Bearcats again begin the breakout, try to go through center ice, and a nice keep there by Porzondek. Porzondek passed down to the corner of the wall. Wall puts it behind the boards, or behind the net toward Gonzalez, and gets it right back. Seeing a little bit of pressure from 55, puck goes into the slot, and the goalie covers it before Huskies were able to get a stick on it. Again, if you are near, I encourage you guys to come out, bring the kids, bring the adults, bring the grandparents to and I, skate with the skis after the game tomorrow. Skate rental is open. I encourage you guys to come and join us if you can. Gonzalez taking the face off against Portel. Bearcats win the face off, bringing it around the boards, kicking it out. Quick jump across by Porzondaco. There, not letting the Bearcats gain possession. Porzondek holds it behind the net, pass it up through center ice, and a nice keep there 
by the Bearcats. Put it back in the Huskies' possession and a trip delayed penalty here on the Bearcats giving us a Husky power play. Hopefully we can capitalize on this and get a quick goal. We had a great power play. One of the great attributes of this team is the power play. If you guys tune in in previous games, you saw that we actually score a couple goals off that. So hopefully we can do that, that here and lead the game off. We got Pathana taking the face off down in the Bearcats zone for the five on four. Two minutes up on the clock at number 14 for the Bearcats with a tripping penalty. Huskies win the face off. Peters over to Evans. Right back to Peters. Takes a weird bounce right off the stick. Putting it out of the zone. Peters brings it back, puts it off the boards over to Walney. Walney, pass through neutralize over to Evans. Evans goes off the boards into the Bearcats zone. Bearcats get a touch on it, putting back to the D and a nice icing down in the Husky zone. Fucci steps out, pass it over to Peters. Peters holds it behind the net as the Huskies set up their power play. Peters carries it through neutral ice, gaining some speed through the neutral zone. Over to Evans. Evans picks it up, passes it behind him over to Walney. And Pathana picks it up behind the net. A lot of back and forth here again for the skis and the Bearcats. Puck leaves the zone on a Porzondak stick. Porzondak holds it, passing it through neutral ice over to Martin. Martin has a nice pass there over to Pathana. Pathana passes through neutral ice over to Porzondak. Porzondak with quick wraparound, hitting the ref in the leg, causing there not to be near as much power as it was when it left his stick. Again, Bearcats. Attempt to ice it out, and nice stop there by Porzondek to bring it back deep into the Bearcat zone. Nice step up and a shot there on net, and a nice save by the goalie. Another shot by Porzondek, missing the net high. I think we're bounced two shots by Porzondek, barely missing the net to the left. And Bearcats are able to get a touch on it, getting it again out of their zone. Had a great couple of shots there. Had a nice pass there by Vucci over to Wall. Ball back to Apper as he starts to receive some pressure from the Bearcats. Again, fine from the zone. Bearcats come out on top. We got a two-on-one foreman here with Vucci coming back. Backdoor pass and a goal for the Bearcats. Making this a zero-to-one game for the Huskies. Fortunately, Porzondek was just a set behind and was unable to tie up that backdoor guy. And we got 11.26 here remaining in the first period. A mere three seconds remaining in the Husky power play. You got Martin here taking the face off in between Rizuko and Kieski with Anderson and Marks backing him up on defense. A nice win there over to Kieski. Pass right back to Marks, and Marks had a nice shot on net from neutral ice. Had it right there, stopped there by Rizuko, falling in the corner, holding the puck. Martin and Rizuko. Get it up. Nice keep there by Anderson, tying up the guy on the point. We got a two on two, three on two foreman here. 55, goes right pass, and a nice stop by March. Not letting that, letting that pass get through. They got a lot of back and forth here in the neutral zone. Bearcats come out on top, dumbing it down deep into the Husky zone. March picks it up in the corner, goes for a pass, and a nice tip there by Bearcats, putting it right back on their stick. And Anderson holds it behind the net, pass it up on the boards over to Gieski. Barely missing the pass, put it down deep in the Husky zone, and March comes out on top, pass to Rizuko, puts it deep into the Bearcats zone. Pathana with a nice skate there, putting pressure on 61, forcing him to pass the puck up the boards. See Bearcats swinging behind the net, still in possession of the puck, 22. Holding it, waiting to make something out of it. Has a nice toe drag there, shot on net, and a nice save by Vucci. Evans Holt fighting in the corner there for it, and the Bearcats keep possession. Puck comes out on a 61 stick for a quick shot on net. A tip by 21, redirecting it luckily away from the net. Bearcats come out, another shot on Attempted shot on net. We got someone dropped up. Peters on the ice, not moving. 
Whistle blows and looks like Peter took a shot. Don't quite know where. But he is on the ice. Got the medic coming out for Peters there. You see some movement from Peters. He's on his knees. Lifting his head up. If you just now tuning in, I encourage you guys to take the chance on coming out to, for tomorrow's game if you can at 5 o'clock p.m. Central Time. We got the Skate with the Skis. If you'd like to come out, bring the kids, the parents, the grandparents, anyone you can. Come and join the team on the ice after the game tomorrow. We got Peters, he took his helmet off there. And getting up. Taking Peters over to the bench, luckily not to the locker room. If it was the locker room, he'd probably mean he was done for the game, so hopefully he took a bruise to the bone. Hopefully we'll see him continue later. 9.36 here remaining in the first period. Trying to see what Peters is holding over there, what he hurt. as the Huskies start their lineup. Gonzalez taking the face off, and a quick shot on net right into Vucci's glove, and another stoppage of play. Ken Gonzalez taking the face off. Bearcats come out on top, quick shot on net. And nice stop there by Marks, not letting the puck get to the net. Huskies come out on top, Gonzalez skating it out of the zone, into the neutral zone. Brings it into the Bearcat zone, where Bearcats are able to get a touch on it, put it back in their possession. Marks with a nice step up there, keeping it in the Bearcats zone. And a nice out there by Porzondek, not letting Bearcats bring it into the Husky zone. Porzondek comes out on top, one on one here, goes for a quick shot and a nice save by the goalie. And again, Porzondek with a tip, putting it back in the Huskies possession. Bearcats pass across the ice over to Rizuko. Rizuko again skating it down into the Bearcats zone. Rizuko over to Martin. Martin with an attempted shot on net with 14 on the Bearcats. Having a nice shot block there. Kiski goes for an attempted pass across. Redirected by Bearcats as they dump it down deep in the Husky zone. Bucci gets the puck passing it over to Bry there. Try a lot of back and forth here. Putting right back on. Again, Bryce stepping up. And Bearcats gonna come out on top. Nice step up there by Evans. Hitting the guy skating in, knocking him off the puck. Puck goes over to Gieski. Gieski off the boards, back into Bearcats possession. Nice step up there and hit by Bry, putting the puck back into the Huskies possession. And Evans there fighting it on the boards. Nice pass over to Rizuko. Rizuko gets it deep into the Bearcats zone. Bearcats put up those boards. A nice keep there by Porzondek. Nice hit there as well, but Bearcats get into the Husky zone. Two on two here, shot into Vucci's chest. And a nice save. We got a little bit of shoving here, breaking out in front of the net. But nothing seemed to came of it. The the refs were able to get over there before anything started. Getting some fresh legs out. New forward line for the Bearcats. Number nine taking the face off for the Bearcats. And Pathana taking the face off for the Skis. A stick goes flying. Clements lost his stick. A quick attempt to shot there. Nice skate out. Walney carrying across the red line. And a hit there, putting the puck back in a Bearcats possession. Clement had a nice step up there, dropping the shoulder, and the guy stopped and was able to get the puck off of his stick, causing the stick or puck to go back down deep in the Bearcats zone. Getting a lot of back and forth here. Marks with a good step up. Not letting that puck leave that zone. Fighting, 
right inside the blue line. Calls that an off size after it barely dances over the blue line. We got six minutes and 50 seconds here remaining on the clock. Again, we got Peter sitting up on the bench over there. He's talking to people, so it seems like he is fine. Still's got his helmet off, and he still hasn't gotten up yet. So hopefully it's just a, again, a bruised bone or something that's not prohibiting. Pass D to D for the Bearcats. Back over to 21. Pass right in front of the net, and a shot, and a nice save by Vucci. Had a net to shoot on there with no defense in sight. Vucci's able to fairly tip it off his shoulder pad, getting it above the net. Rudon takes a hit almost right to the face. Refs didn't seem to see it. In the puck stays in Bearcats possession. Evans fighting in the corner there. Bearcats come out on top with the puck. Sorry, Huskies come out on top of the puck. Evans is getting out of the Husky zone. Tries to go through the center. And Bearcats again come out on top. We got a three on two here. Three on three, 21 for a shot. And scoring, making this a two to zero game for the Bearcats. Had a nice shot there by the Bearcats, putting it in the left side of the net. Barely sneaking next to Vucci's pad. Got Martin here taking the face off in between Rosuko and Kieski at center ice with Marks and Porzondak backing them up. Porzondak gets the puck in the corner. Going off the boards, Bearcats pick it up, 49, pass it across. Goes for a backdoor shot, barely missing the pass, not letting a shot go on net. Got a lot of back and forth here, Bearcats. Goes for a shot from the point and a nice save by Vucci. Both teams getting some fresh legs out here. Getting ready to play the last five and a half minutes up on the clock. Pathana taking the face off against number 29 for the Bearcats. A nice redirect of that pass there by Marks, putting it onto Pathana's stick. Passing it off the boards over to Clement. Clement picks it up in the corner, passes up with Borzondek. Borzondek with a quick shot. And a nice save there by the goalie. Another shot by Porzani goes back door. Goalie does the splits, not let that backdoor shot go in. Keeping this a zero to two game. Marks has a nice pinch there, keeping it in the Bearcats zone. 55 for the Bearcats. Pick it up, begin their breakout out of their zone. Skating it into the Husky's own quick shot on net and a nice save by Vucci. Bearcats gain possession down in the Husky zone. Number nine picking it up. Nice step up there by Gonzalez, knocking it into the Husky's possession. Quick step up by March. Not letting him get a breakaway off. Got a 71 for the Bearcats, coming down, bringing it behind the Husky net. Passing it up to the blue line, up to the Bearcats point. Quick shot on net, another save by Vucci. 38 puts it in the slot where Huskies pick it up after. Carrying it through center ice. Bearcats pick off, pass. And again, begin their breakout. 17, pass over to 38. 38 with an attempted shot getting redirected by Martin in the net above the glass. Saw a little something breaking out there between Martin and number 38 for the Bearcats. Luckily, rest are able to again get there before anything came out of it. Martin taking the face off against Richardson for the Bearcats. 
Skis win the faceoff. Went back to Przondak. Przondak wraps it around the boards. Gets tipped off of Bearcats and down deep into the Bearcats zone. Bearcats pass it right to Martin. Martin for a quick shot. Barely missing that at high. 81 for the Bearcats. Passing it over to 22 for a get a quick whistle there. Well, it seems one of the players down in the Bearcats zone was on the ice. One of the Bearcats, number 14, are screaming something at one of the Husky players. The ref is able to get there and stop him before anything again comes out of it. Game is getting a little chippy, but the refs are really doing everything they can to get in there between, before anything stops. See 21 stick for the Bearcats fly out of his hand. Not holding it too tight there. 77 for the Bearcats. Goes for an intent to pass off. Anderson. Has a nice sneak around one of their Bearcats defensemen. Okay. See some nice pressure there by Martin as Huskies get again game, game possession. Gieski over to Porzondak. Porzondak goes deep into the Bearcats zone. 77 for the Bearcats passes off the boards. Back in Huskies possession. Zuko getting down deep into the Bearcats zone. Takes a weird bounce off the boards there, but Porzondak picks it up, passing him back to Evans. Evans over to Pathana. Pathana bringing it back. Center ice over to Porzondak, and a nice, again, dump down deep into the Bearcats zone. Bearcat, Bearcats goalie covers it, causes another stoppage play here. It's just two minutes and 22 seconds remaining. Got Pathana here taking the face off against number 29, Anson Smith. Huskies win the face off, and a nice one timer there by Evans, putting it right into the goalie's glove for another quick stoppage of play. Again, we got Smith for the Bearcats taking the face off against Pathana down in the Bearcats zone. Huskies come out on top after the faceoff there. Walney goes for an attempt to pass through center ice on a redirect there by number nine for the Bearcats. Evans picks up the puck down in the Husky zone, passing it off the boards. Going over to 29, 29 and number nine, nine for a quick shot and a nice shot block there by Walney. Evans passes it up to Walney with a nice kick pass right back to Evans. Fortunately, number 55 is able to step up the Bearcats and intercept the pass. A lot of back and forth here. Clement is getting into the Bearcats zone, stopping. Pass across over to Gonzalez. Again, Bearcats picking it up after the pass is incomplete. Ref got in the way there, putting it back into Husky's possession. Evans for a shot right into the goalie's glove. Again, getting a lot of shot opportunities here. If we start capitalizing on them, it's going to be an interesting game. Again, Dallier for the Bearcats. Great goalie, one of the better goalies we've seen so far this year. Stopping a lot of shots and a couple of splits to get those backdoor saves. Putting up a challenge for the Huskies. Bearcats ringing around the boards, takes a weird bounce off the glass, puts it into Wall's possession. Again, up the boards. Attempts to step up there by March, making this a two on one. Got the forwards back checking. Quick shot there and a nice save by Vucci. We got a minute here remaining in the first period. Puck leaves the Husky zone, still in the Bearcats' possession. 23 for the Bearcats, pass it across. Over to 14, 14 carries it in the Husky zone. 14 back to 39, where Gonzalez is able to intercept the pass before they get a shot off. A lot of back and forth here in the corner. The puck seems to be pinned. We got two white jerseys and two purple jerseys down there. One of them's Gonzalez. We got Marks fighting in the corner there. Bearcats come out on top, goes for a shot on net. Going through Ibuchi's five hole, making this a zero to three game with 
24 seconds remaining. And again, we had uh, Porzondek with an unsportsmanlike penalty after he shot one of the other team player sticks, one of the Bearcat sticks away after that goal was scored. So it's a zero to three game with 24 seconds remaining in the first period. You got Evans here talking to the refs with the C on his jersey. And the Huskies are on a penalty kill. Martin here taking the face off against number 29 at center ice. Bearcats coming on top of the face off. 71 puts it over to Bry Stick. Bry had a nice redirect pass there, getting it back out of the Huskies zone. Bearcats get it deep with 10 seconds remaining in the first period. Bry fighting in the corner. Five seconds here remaining. Bearcats get it up on the point for a quick shot. A nice save by Vucci. Martin holds it behind the net, receiving a little pressure from 71. And that is the final the buzzer for the end of the first. Ladies and gentlemen, if you tune in here to watch us, I appreciate it. I encourage you guys to come back in about 15 minutes for the start of the second period. It is a 0-3 to three game right now with the Bearcats up. And we'll be right back with the start of the second period. And just a quick update here. We got the Bearcats with 12 shots and the Husky with nine at the final of the first period.
Ladies and gentlemen, we are back here with the start of the second period, starting here in about two minutes. Again, thank you if you are tuning in here with us tonight. I also would like to take a uh, moment of silence to talk about. We had a loss here for Zondax, grandparent, unfortunately lost his life, passed away. We'd like to offer our condolences to him and we're going to be dedicating today's and tomorrow's game to him. So to Porzondak's family, if you are tuning in with us here tonight, I just want to say that we are very sorry for your loss here at the NIU Huskies. And we are, like I said, donating the, dedicating the game to him today. Huskies are skating out here right now. Both teams jumping out, getting ready for the start of the second period. And if you are near, I encourage you guys to come out tomorrow. We have our Skate with the Skis after the game tomorrow, about 5 o'clock is the game, and instantly after the game, I know the guys are going to be out here on an open sheet of ice. we got skate rentals here at Canland Ice Arena. So again, I encourage you guys, bring the kids, bring the parents, bring the grandparents if you can, get you a pair of skates. And we got a couple of little chillings. I know the guys are going to be signing a couple of pucks for them. And if you haven't already, please go check out our website at niuicehockey.com where you can check out all our latest updates, game times, and we do have some sweatshirts and t-shirts for sale. So I encourage you guys to go out, check it out. What now? We got the start of the second period here. We still got a minute 35 penalty kill for the skis. Bearcats come out on top off the drop of the puck at center ice. Bearcats begin the breakout, skating through center ice. We had Evans going in with attempted hit there, barely missing the guy. Quick shot on Bucci and a nice save. Keeping the puck out of the net. Again, Skis get a quick dump down into the Bearcats' zone as they get set up for their penalty kill. Bearcats begin the breakout with number 77, passing it over to 61. 61 carrying it into the Husky zone. Stop on the hash marks. Pass up to the point, back to 77. 77 over to 49. 49, 17, right back to 49. Puck goes back over to 77 on the point, back to 61. 61 goes in our attempt to pass through center ice, and a nice stop there by Gonzalez. Ice on the puck, back down deep into the Bearcats zone. Again, Bearcats begin their setup right behind the net, begin skating out with 20 seconds here remaining on the penalty kill. Bearcats get it up on the point. Pass back down, 55, goes for a shot. A quick shot block there by Pathana. Get it out of the Husky zone. We got one, zero seconds here, back to even play. And we got Clement jumping out as we go back to five on five hockey. We saw a nice intercept there by Pathana as he took the attempt to pass, took it right in the foot, directing it into the Huskies bench. Seems to hit his foot kind of bad there as he gets off the ice limping. Update about Keaton Peters. Just talking to him, he took the puck to the uh, inner side of his left knee, I believe, and he is attempting to play again this period, so hopefully we'll see him out here pretty soon. Quick shot on Lucci, barely missing the net to the left. His Bearcats hold it down in the Husky zone, and the puck goes right into Vucci's chest for a quick blow of the whistle. Get another stoppage of play here after a great save by Vucci. We got Martin taking the face off against Davis for the Bearcats. The puck is dropped and the Bearcats come out on top from the faceoff. 29 skates behind the net, goes for a pass to center ice and a nice redirect there by March. Goes for an attempted shot to the back, missing the net to the back left. And again, nice stop there by Martin, not letting the puck get to the net. Rizuko steps in, chips it off the glass, you know, out of the Husky zone, carries it into 
Bearcats own with a loose puck in front of the net. Two, three shots there. Goalie's on his back as Martin goes for another shot, and the goalie's able to, barely able to get in front, keeping this a zero to three game. That was a crazy couple of seconds there. As the rest blow the whistle for an icing against the Bearcats. Again, we saw a quick back one, two, three, four shots on the Bearcats goalie, Valier, and had a great couple saves. He was on a stomach there facing towards the net, but he was able to get up and do the splits across the net, get a nice save on that fourth shot there. Bearcats come out on top, getting out of the zone, and we had a tripping call against the Huskies, making this another Husky penalty kill. We got Evans going into the box there as we have a, another four on five situation. We have McCormick here taking the face off against Gonzalez. And Bearcats come out on top of the face off. Puck goes up to 77, over to 49, right back down to 29. Goes for attempted backdoor pass. And after, had a nice stick there, not letting it go through. Puck in goes back up to 77, back over to 49. 49 with a quick shot, redirected by Gonzalez. Again, there's Peters down there. We got Peters back out on the ice. Putting pressure on the Bearcats, getting it out of the zone. 77 passing it up to number 29 for the Bearcats. And a nice touch there. Drops it back to 23 over to 17. 17 holds it down in the corner. Passing it up to 23 who misses the pass making the puck go out of the Husky zone. 23 carrying it through center ice back into the Husky zone. Carrying it behind the Husky net. Pass on the puck over to 77. 77 down to 17. 17 goes behind the net to 81. 81 up to 22. 22 over to 81 for the Bearcats. Back over to 77. 77 brings it up on top of the point. Passes down to 81, 81 with a quick shot. Missed the net to the back right. Again, 22 gets the puck up on the point. Passing over to 77. 77 goes for an attempted shot with a nice shot block there by Gonzalez, redirected into the rafters for another out of play whistle. Getting some fresh legs out here for the Huskies and we still got 26 seconds remaining on the penalty kill. 22 taking the face off. For the Bearcats, we got Pathana for the Huskies. Bearcats come out on top with the face off. 21 over to 55, back to 21. 21, quick shot. An attempt to redirect by 39. And a quick blow of the whistle after a nice save by Vucci. Again. Lining up here down on the Husky zone. Pathana taking the face off. Huskies win the face off. Puck over to March with attempted off the glass. We had a very nice keep there by 21 for the Bearcats. Ref takes the puck right in the thigh, keeping it in the Husky zone. And we're back to five on five hockey here with a successful penalty kill by the Huskies. Bearcats carry it into the Husky zone, passing it behind him over to 81. 81 pass behind the net where Pathana picks it up. Pathana puts it off the glass and gets it out of the Husky zone yet again. 14 picks the puck up, pass for 81, pass it right back. And the Bob Bearcats ice it down into the Husky zone for another quick whistle, causing the puck to be dropped back down into the Bearcats zone. And again, got the refs talking. We got number 14 and the Bearcats talking to the ref. Doesn't seem too happy.
I saw an attempted late change there by the Bearcats. Falling 81 and 22 back on the ice. Puck still drop, being dropped back down in the Bearcats zone stand side. 81 taking the face off against Martin. Huskies win the face off over to 20. Evans with a quick shot right in front of the net. Again, we see Gieske getting ahead a little bit in front of the net. Luckily, again, nothing came out of it. Russ were able to get over there in the nick of time before anything came out of it. Again, we had a nice shot there by Evans and a nice save there by Dallier. Martin taking the face off against Portel. Huskies come out on top, getting it into the Bearcats' corner as the Bearcats pick it up again. The breakout, a nice keep there by Martin, not letting it leave the Bearcats' zone. Puck gets rung around, over back in the Bearcats' possession. Number three for Bearcats passes it right to Martin's stick. Martin over to Evans. Evans gets it deep down in the Bearcats' zone. Again, a lot of back and forth here. No clear possession between the two teams. Puck goes on the board to number three for the Bearcats. Pick it up. Nice back check there by Evans. Not letting them get a shot off. Peters passed out behind the net. An attempted shot, but Martin had a nice dive there. Not letting the puck go through. Again, another quick shot there. and Nice save by Vucci. Number three for Bearcats shoots. Another save by Vucci. Martin picks it up and gets it out of the Husky zone. Bearcats pick it up and neutralize, dumbing it down deep in the Husky zone. Fucci goes for an attempted pass, putting the puck right in front of the net where a Bearcats player was. Luckily, the Bearcats player missed it, keeping this a 0-3 game. Peters picks it up down in the Husky zone, passes it off the boards to Gonzalez, barely missing a stick, putting it back in the Bearcats' possession. 93. Skates it in. A nice quick stop there by Peters. A reach around, not letting the Bearcats get their shot off. Peters goes off the boards down deep into the Bearcats zone with a icing whistle, causing the play to be dropped back down in the Huskies zone. Again, we saw a little bit of a risky play there by Vucci. He's jumped behind the net trying to make a pass, or unfortunately it looked like it rolled off his stick weird putting it in a Bearcats possession right in front of the net. Luckily, he missed the pass because he had an empty net to shoot on. 12.54 here remaining in the second period. Bearcats win off the faceoff, bringing it behind the net around the boards. Again, a lot of back and forth here down in the corner. Gonzalez comes out on top, passing up to after. After passes, attempts to go through neutralize, putting it on a 71 stick, who puts it into the Husky zone again. Peters goes off the boards. Bearcats pick it up, pass it behind him. Over to 71, 71 back to 55. 55 goes, tries to go off the boards. It goes back down to 71, 71 puts the puck right in the net. Quick save by Vucci after a shot from a loose puck in the slot. Getting some fresh legs out for both teams. We got Pathana here to take the face off against Richardson for the Bearcats. Bearcats win the face off. Put up to 25-25 with a quick shot right back into Vucci's glove for another quick whistle. 12.08 here remaining in the second period. Again, you got Alex Santa behind the microphone and you got Sean Cerny behind the camera. Thank you guys for supporting us here if you're tuned in with us. Again, got Pathana taking the face off. Bearcats step up, go for a quick shot. And Wolny, a nice shot block there as he drops out and gets back up and has a breakaway. A quick shot and a Husky goal! Making this a one to three game. Ladies and gentlemen, we had Wolny with a very nice shot block there. 
letting him get a quick breakaway and letting him pick it up, put it in the back of the Bearcats' net. Again, ladies and gentlemen here, sorry for not updating the score. I am doing that as I speak. It is a one of three game with the Bearcats up. Puck gets dumped down deep into the Husky zone. There's a lot of back and forth here. Pathana comes out on top. Puts it up to Clement. Clement got two on one here. Clement passes it into the net. Goalie deflects it away from the net. And a nice keep there by Anderson. Put it back into Bearcats' possession. Number eight for Bearcats, chips it deep into the Husky zone. Puck goes up, and number 55's possession, putting it down deep into the Husky zone again. Pierce fighting on the boards. As he's able to get a nice pass across the defense and get it out of the zone. For Zondak, holding it down in the Husky zone, goes through a pass through neutral ice, back in the Bearcats' possession. Pierce steps up, carries it into the Bearcats' zone, goes for an attempt to quick shot, nice back check there by the Bearcats, not letting him get that shot off. Martin picks up the puck, goes off the boards, right to Porzondek, Porzondek with a quick shot, and the puck gets redirected away from the net. 55 for the Bearcats, pick it up in the corner, and flick it out of the zone. So no icing being called yet, number 17 for the Bearcats beating Oskis down in the corner. Laid off sides, Porzondek steps up, dumps it down deep into the Bearcat zone for another offsides whistle. Puck's being dropped back down here in the Husky zone as the Bearcats get a couple of fresh legs out. We got Smith here taking the face off against Martin for the skis. The puck is dropped and the Huskies come out on top from the drop of the puck. Getting tied up on the boards down in the corner. And 71 comes out on top, passes 29, goes for a quick shot, barely missing the net to the left. And a quick save there by Vucci. Had a loose puck, took a couple of weird bounces, and Vucci's able to get there just in the nick of time to get a glove on the puck. Ski's getting some fresh legs out as we got 10 minutes and four seconds remaining in the second period. Peters passes through neutralized for a delayed off sides against the Bearcats. Wall brings it in the net, two on one, goes for a shot into the goalie's chest. Dallier's chest with a nice quick save and a blow of the whistle. Getting a lot of opportunities here for the skis, a lot of scoring opportunities, a lot of shots. We got Dalier, causing a bit of a challenge for the skis, not letting any pucks through. Again, we got Vucci playing great this game as well, not letting any pucks sliding back and forth. Got great rebound control so far this game. We got Gonzalez here taking the face off. Bearcats coming on top, bringing it around. We got 38 for Bearcats, almost on the breakaway, tripping over his own feet and falling, so the skis can have. Another two on two here. Wall, pass it over. Goes for an attempt to pass to Gonzalez and Dalier is able to get a snag on it before the pass was completed. Again, if you haven't already, go check out our website at www.niuicehockey.com. You can check out our latest game schedule, latest promotions, latest events. And you can go check out the swag we got for sale. We got some t-shirts and sweatshirts with the NIU Husky logo on it. Evans with a quick slap shot, barely missing the net to the left. And Peter steps up, not letting the puck leave the zone. And a lot of back and forth, puck bobs straight up. Bearcats come in possession. We got Thana really putting pressure on the Bearcats, not letting him get a clean possession on the puck. Bearcats are able to get out of their zone with number 49 skating in the Huskies zone. And Walney putting some nice pressure, turning the puck back over to the Huskies' possession. 
and a whistle. Trying to figure out what that whistle is for. It was an offsides whistle against the Huskies. Fortunately, I think it was just a tad bit over for the puck was carried over. Got Martin taking the face off between Gieski and Rizuko. And Bearcats come out on top, but it quickly goes back into the Huskies' possession as we get it deep into the Bearcats' zone. Martin picks it, the puck up on the board, skates it in, goes for a quick shot, and a nice shot block there by number eight on the Bearcats. You got a one on two here. Number 39 goes for a shot, missing the net to the left, letting the puck leave the Husky zone again, putting back into the Bearcats zone. Martin putting some great pressure there on number 49. 49 passes behind the net over to 23 as he begins his breakout. 49 gets the puck right back. Not getting a shot off, puck goes behind the net. Loose puck in front of the net, Huskies get it out again. And a nice tip there by Rizuko. Not letting that pass be completed. We got a delayed offsides here against the Bearcats as the Huskies begin their breakout. Quick chip there by Rizuko getting down deep into the Bearcats zone. Espathana keeps it up on the point, keeping it in and taking the hit to make a nice play there, knocking about deep into the Husky, or the Bearcats zone. Quick pass behind the net there for the Bearcats. They got a one on two here, a 22 for the Bearcats, putting it through his feet, and a quick shot there by Porzondek, not letting him get a shot off. 68 coming in for a quick shot on Vucci and a quick save, putting the puck back in Bearcats possession. 61 with another quick shot, and a shot blocked by Clement. Fry's able to get that pass over to Clement. Clement skates it in, stops, goes to that pass through neutral ice over to Bry. As it went into Bry's feet and Bearcats are able to capitalize on that, get possession. Horzon next skates back into the Husky zone, picking up the puck, looking for that open pass. Quick pass through neutral ice. Anderson tips it down, putting it into the Bearcats corner. And a quick whistle for a high stick against the skis. Still a 1-3 game here with there being seven minutes and one second remaining in the second period. Again, we got uh, that one goal being a great assist, or sorry, an unassisted goal by Walney. Taking the shot block up from the point, skating it down center ice and Having a nice quick goal on Dallier. Hopefully that was the one goal to get us rolling here. Only down by two and we still got plenty of game time left. Bearcats coming on top of the face off. Gonzalez with a great shot block. We got a breakaway here. Quick shot, barely missing the net to the right by Wall. Another quick shot back door. Again, missing the net to the left. Wall puts it behind the net, back over to after. Two great scoring opportunities here where unfortunately we missed the net, but hopefully it'll come back again. Bearcats come out on top from behind the net and begin their breakout. Porzondek knocks the puck out of the air, stopping the three on two on hand. Martin knocks 29 for the Bearcats off the puck, getting it back down to Anderson. Anderson back to Porzondek. Anderson again picks it back up from Porzondek's pass, puts it up to after. Quick step up there by Porzondek, not letting Bearcats skate it into the Husky zone too far. 14, pass it up to 25. Goes for an attempt to pass down the center ice. Porzondek steps up, goes through the air. 71 for Bearcats, catch it out of the air. Get a quick turnaround after, flying, getting that puck, going for a quick shot on net, and a nice save by Dallier. Bearcats put it behind the net, passing over 14, 14 to 17. Anderson with a quick stop, 17, taking the puck, got two on one here, 17, goes to that backdoor pass, and a quick redirect by Porzondek, putting it into Avucci's glove, keeping this a one to three game. See the Huskies really stepping up here, came out flying this period, I think they needed the energy from Walney's goal, to get a little more motivated, and see some light at the end of the tunnel here. 
23 taking the face off against Pathana for the skis. Down to the Husky zone, stand side. Bearcats quick shot on net and a quick save by Bucci. Evans tying up the puck behind the net. Bearcats come out on top. Again, Pathana right on him again, tying him and the puck up. Goes out to, for a quick shot on Bucci. By number 55, puck goes out of play, hitting the net above the glass. But again, Bucci, I don't think he even really saw that shot. Bounce off his shoulder, going straight up into the net above the glass. 5.15 here remaining in the second period as Huskies line up down in the Husky zone bench side. Refs calling, uh, seems like a new center maybe. All three refs coming in, talking, having a quick little talk of what just happened there. Same center for the Bearcats. Number eight goes for a quick shot from the point. Barely missing the net to the left. Puck gets tied up behind the net. Quick hit there by Walney, letting Pathana pick up the pucks, get it out of the zone. Gets across the red line, goes for a quick shot on net. And Bearcats, goalie Dallier is able to get a save on it. Calls it for another quick whistle. Got some Bruno and Mars playing here on the speakers as both teams are changing, getting some fresh legs out. Gonzalez taking the face off against Brockhart. Quick shot there by Evans and a nice redirect by 21 for the Bearcats. A lot of back and forth, puck goes up loose in the slot. Evans with a nice keep shot on net, barely. The attempted redirect by a wall, barely missing the net by about two inches. Got a hand pass by after there, knocking it out of the air with his glove, where Walls picked it up. Causing the puck to be dropped right outside of the Bearcats zone. For the past couple minutes here, we've really been able to keep the puck in the Bearcats zone. Huskies are doing a great job of controlling it, keeping it on their sticks and having crisp tape to tape passes. 81 comes out on top from the faceoff. Picks up by Porzondek, knocking it off the stick. Puck goes down the Bearcats possession, wraps it around 77, picks it up in the corner. Goes through the slot where Marks picks it up. Marks skating it down across the red line into the Bearcats zone. Passes across through neutral ice for Bearcats able to get the stick on it, redirecting it away from the Husky sticks. 77 for Bearcats. Put it off, 21 stick. And 22, we got a one-on-one -on -one here. Marks against number 22. And I stopped there by Marks, not letting him get a shot off, putting pressure on him. Pass behind his back into Vucci's glove. We saw an attempted catch of the pass there by, I believe, Rizuko, popping the puck in the air into Vucci's glove. Luckily, he saw that just in the nick of time, not letting it sneak by him. 3.52 remaining in the second period. Huskies are down one to three right now. Martin taking the face off, winning it back to Evans. Evans holding it down on the corner. Evans brings it behind the net, pass up through neutral ice over to Rizuko, barely missing the pass with his hand, goes into Bearcats possession. Had a great hit there by Evans, stepping up, hit number 29 as he skates straight to the bench of the ice, seemed to maybe knock the wind out of him or something, not letting him skate it in the zone. Rizuko really fighting for the puck. Not letting the bear, anything come over with the Bearcats, and the puck goes out of play into the Husky stands. Almost got a little bit chirpy there. The rest again got there just in the nick of time, not let anything come out of it. Still three minutes and 20 seconds remaining in the second period. We got Pathana taking the face off just outside of the Husky zone against Alexandrov. Bearcats win the face off, dump down deep into the Husky zone. 
where Peters picks it up. Peters goes off the boards. Puck goes up to number 25 for the Bearcats, who puts it down to attempt down to 24. Peters picked it up, passed it to Kualni, got it right back to Peters over to Clement. Peters down deep in the Bearcats zone. A lot of back and forth here in the corner. No clear possession from either team. Walney comes out on top. Walney pass up to the point to Evans. Evans with a quick shot. And a nice shot block by the Bearcats, number 23. Evans has a quick turnaround there again, skating right back into the Bearcats zone. Goes a backhanded shot right into the goalie's chest for a quick save by Dallier. Yeah, we see the Huskies really coming out and fighting today. They came with their skates hitting the ice fast. Spending a lot of time down in the Bearcat zone. If we could just start capitalizing on shots, picking corners here. It is a very winnable game today. Gonzalez taking the face off against Noble. One of the face off goes back to Marks. Marks the quick shot. And a Gonzalez possession. Gonzalez puts it behind his back off the boards to keep possession of the puck. Fortunately, the Bearcats is able to get a touch on it. For Zondek stepping up. We got a two on one coming out here. Marks, quick shot by Bearcats, and missing the net high, giving us a one to three game, causing the puck to get rung around down deep into the Bearcats zone. Bearcats go off the board. Wall with quick shot, and a nice save by Dollier. Again, Huskies really fighting after, picks it up at the top of the circle, putting it down deep over to Wall. Gonzalez in front of the net goes for a shot. Number eight is able to get a touch on it. 55 for the Bearcats. Go to skate it out of the zone. Pass over to three and a nice intercept there by the Skis. Number 17 goes for a quick shot on Vucci going off the corner of the net. Not the post, not the crossbar, but perfectly in the corner. Luckily bouncing away from the net. Quick shot. It gets redirected by the Bearcats away from the Skis net. Number three goes in for a shot, passes it back to 17, gets a loose puck in the slot, and Huskies come out on top. 55 goes for a dump down back into the Huskies zone. Martin settles it in the corner, pass it up to After. After tries to hold it, 22 came flying, putting it back in Bearcats' possession. Got a minute left here in the second period. As the Bearcats skate it back into the Huskies zone. Nice step up there by Porzondak, knocking it off the Bearcats' stick. Not letting him get a shot off. Gieske jumps down to the corner, pins the puck on the board as Marks come in, comes in to help him out. The puck is not moving. Russ yelling at him to move the puck, but nothing seems to be happening. Marks comes out on top, bringing it around the boards, putting it back to 61 stick for the Bearcats. 61 over to 77. Back to 61. 61 passes through, neutralized back, 77's possession. Goes down deep in the Husky zone. Marks fighting for it in the corner. Pass it to 77, goes for a quick shot of net. Nice save by Vucci. Loose puck in front of the net. Huskies are able to get it out. 25 for a quick shot. Barely missing the net to the right after a nice save by Vucci. Quick slap shot, knuckle puck there. You know that as the buzzer for the end of the second period buzzes. We got Huskies down one to three at the end of the second period. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in for the second period and the first period if you're here as well. Again, if you weren't here for the start of the second period, today we are dedicating today's game to Porzondak's grandparent who unfortunately passed away this earlier this week. So we give our condolences over to Porzondak's family and are very sorry for you guys' loss. And so, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. We'll be back in about 15 minutes with the start of the third period.
Ladies and gentlemen, we are back here at the start of the third period. Huskies down one to three currently, but we still got 20 minutes left here in the third period and one heck of a game in front of us. Then we got the Huskies here lining up. We got Gonzalez taking the face off. Against number 49 for the Bearcats. Alexandrov. Again, Huskies are down one to three, but we got plenty of game time left to go. The puck is dropped. Third period is underway, and Bearcats come on top. Actually, a lot of back and forth here between the Husky and the Bearcats. Ball gets it in the zone. Nice deep dump into Bearcats' zone. And Alexandros pass it up to number 23. Goes back in Husky's possession and back in the Bearcats' possession. A lot of back and forth here. Again, no clear possession, but it is down in the Bearcats' zone. Bearcats break it out. 23 carrying it into the Husky zone. Cuts across the top of the ice pass down to 49 with a missed attempted one timer. Again, Huskies breaking it out of the zone. Goes for a pass across. 49 for the Bearcats pick it up. Then we're down again getting it deep into the Husky zone. Peters passes it up to Evans, passing it right back to Pathana. Pathana carrying it in the Bearcats zone with some speed and goes right into the glove of Dallier. Again, Pathana taking the face off down in the Bearcats zone. Number 81 for the Bearcats taking the face off. Bearcats pick it up, pass the 21, carries across the red line. And we see Pathana flying, jumping back in that puck before Bearcats is able to pick it up, stopping at a possible breakaway. Quick shot on Vucci, barely saw it, but he had a quick, nice save there. And Marks tipped it out of the Husky zone as Bearcats pick it up and begin their skate back in. Bearcats get it down deep into the Husky zone. Brzondek steps up, ring it, rings it off the glass, getting it out of the Husky zone yet again. Rizuko comes out flying, able to knock it off. Martin picks it up, puts it back to Rizuko, who puts it down deep into the Bearcats zone. Dallier. Passes it over to 14, who holds it behind the Bearcats net. Bearcats begin to set up their breakout. Getting it out of their zone and into the Husky zone. Number 55 goes for a quick shot on that, missing the net to the back. Goes for another quick shot, nice save by Vucci. Two saves by Vucci. And Porzondek had a nice backhanded pass out of the Husky zone, unfortunately icing it, bringing it back down the Husky zone. Luckily, like I said, it, Occasionally that is a skillful play there. It gives the Huskies its time to again reset up in their own zone, gives them a quick breather before again the drop of the puck. Martin taking the face off for the Huskies against Smith for the Bearcats. NIU comes out on top from the face off for Zondag passes it back to March. Marks goes up the boards, puts it in a 55 possession. 55 goes back. Marks had a nice back check, knocking it off his stick, not letting him get a shot off. Again, Bearcats able to keep it in the zone. 93, pass it behind his back over to Husky's possession, and it leaves the Husky zone. Bearcats carry it back in three on one here. Go for a shot, nice one save by Vucci. And Huskies are able to get it out of the slot. Bearcats in 77 loses it in his feet. Puck's getting stuck on the red line. Bearcats come out on top. 77 over to 71. Nice step up there by Porzondak, carrying it into the Bearcats zone. Wall stepping up. Evans with a nice knockout of the air, putting it back down deep into the Bearcats zone. Evans coming out on top again with the puck. And the own zone pass over to Porzondek. Porzondek passes it through center ice over to Wall. Wall carries it in to the Bearcats zone. Bearcats number 14 had a nice stop there. 
Number three picks it up. One on one here, number three. Bearcats brings it behind the net. Goes for an attempt to pass in the slot. Two saves by Vucci. Three saves by Vucci. Got a hand in the air. And a whistle. We got a holding here on Gonzalez, making this a, another Husky penalty kill. Again, we got a penalty kill for the Huskies here coming up. We got Pathana, again, taking the face off down in the Husky zone, bench side. Bearcats win the face off and a quick, another whistle. We got the ref screaming at number, seems to be figuring out what happened. We had too many men on the ice. We had six purple jerseys on the ice. And it seems the Bearcats coach was a, not too happy about that. I don't know if you guys that picked it up on the microphone. A little bit of screaming there. Again, Pathana taking the face off down in the Husky zone. The four on five penalty kill. 55, holding it up on the point, pass over 21. 21 back to 55, 55 with a shot, going off the outside of the net. Nice step up there by Walney, getting it off of Bearcats possession. Evans able to pick it up. Tries to go through up through center ice. Bear Caps keep it in. Goes for a quick shot. Nice one, two saves by Vucci. Unfortunately, not getting that third one. Bearcats got another quick goal, making this a one to three game for the Bearcats. One to four game for the Bearcats. Bearcats are up, but we still got plenty of time left. We got 15 minutes and 55 seconds. We got a lot of scoring opportunities here. We just need to start capitalizing on. Again, at center ice, we got Martin taking the face off. Against Alexandrov, Huskies come out on top, back to five on five hockey after the Bearcats goal. Bearcats carry it in with the delayed offsides, put in for Zondak's possession, giving him a chance to pass up to Rizuko with a nice chip in. Puck again goes down deep into the Bearcats zone. Peter steps up for a quick shot, putting it right into Dalier's glove. And we got a little bit of something breaking out here between Martin and one of the Bearcats players, 77. Got a couple of punches being thrown. We got Eski stepping in, two more purple jerseys stepping in. And the ref's trying to split it up. Again, we see the ref pulling away, number 77 for the Bearcats. Pulling them out. Trying to figure out what's happening. We got, it seems to be Gieski. Sorry, Martin going to the sin bin for tonight. And 77, we got Martin for the Huskies. And at number 77, Mullins. For the quick little fight, little scrap, couple punches thrown in front of the Dallier there. We have Martin with a four, sorry, both four minute penalties up on the board. We also got 61 in the box for the Bearcats. The rest are talking to the coaches here, trying to figure out what happened. If you haven't already, I encourage you guys to go check out our website at niuicehockey.com where you can check out our schedule, latest up-to-date bits, and you can purchase some of our Husky hockey swag. We got sweatshirts and t-shirts for sale online there, so I encourage you guys to go check it out. If you haven't already, also check out our Instagram with more up-to-date things. Got pictures on there, plenty of pictures of the guys. And latest up to date says they're on well. It's N I U Hockey. This is the handle there for the Instagram. Pucks being dropped down in Bearcats zone. It's 
stand side with Pathana taking the face off. Again, there seems to be some bit of confusion here between the coaches and the refs. Sorry, it seems the penalties are changed back to two minutes apiece. Again, it seems to be some bit of confusion here. Refs telling guys to go in the box. Both the refs are confused. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, trying to figure out what's happening here for the two teams. So I can tell you guys. We got Kiski and Pathana in the box for the Huskies. Both two minute penalties up on the boards and we have four and four on the ice. Huskies come out on top for Zondek. Quick shot on net, two shots, and a nice saves by Dalier. Immediately a 22, got a one on one here. A nice dive by Porzondek, knocking it off 22 stick. 22 up to 14. 14 shot and a nice fly through the center by Porzondek, not letting him get that shot off. Porzondek gets the puck down in the corner. Nice backhanded pass over to Pathana. Puts it down deep into the Bearcat zone, where number 25 picks it up. Porzondek catches it in the neutral zone, passing it back over to Marks. Marks to neutralize back into the Bearcat zone as Huskies get a couple of fresh legs up. Eighty-one for the Bearcats. Skates in in the Husky zone for a quick, quick shot and a nice save by Vucci. Get a lot of back and forth here. Evans comes out on top with the puck and begins skating it out of the Husky zone. Gets it across the red line and into the Bearcat zone. Stops, goes for a pass in the slot, and Bearcats beat him to it, redirecting the pass. Gonzalez picks it up, drops it back over to Evans. Ken Evans gets a pin on the board while Gonzalez swings through, picks up the puck, goes back into Bearcats' possession, who chips it off the glass for 93. Got a two on one coming out here, 55 93 against Peters. Backhanded shot and a nice save by Vucci. Covering it, sorry, kicking it out over to Peters. Nice save there earlier by Vucci. Put the puck that back down into the Bearcats zone. Bearcats are going back and forth here. Nice step up there by Rizuko. Intercept on the pass, gain in possession. Puts it off the boards. And we are back to five on five hockey. We got everyone jumping out of the board or out of the penalty box here. So five on five. Hopefully we can change something in the game. Bearcats step in. 55 with a quick shot. Missing then it high, takes a weird bounce right back in front. Ibuchi again still able to save it for Zondek, able to get it out of the slot. Again, a lot of back and forth, a lot of back and forth here between the two teams, no clear possession. Nice hit by Pierce, down in the corner in the Husky zone. A lot of back and forth getting, uh, we see a stick go flying up in the air. It's about the fourth or fifth stick so far this game. That we've seen fly or a Bearcat circle it. Can't seem to get a good hand on it. And the puck leaves the Husky zone for Zondek flying up, putting pressure on the Bearcats. And the puck goes down deep into the Bearcats zone. Pierce holding it on the Bearcats blue line. Bearcats pick it back up, 55 over to 14. 14 for the Bearcats holds it behind the net as the Bearcats get set up. They begin their skate out, pass it through neutral ice, back down deep in the Husky zone. And we got a quick whistle for an icing against the Bearcats, causing the play to be dropped back down in the Bearcats zone. Puck's getting dropped back down in the Bearcats zone bench side. 49 for the Bearcats taking the face off against Pathano for the Huskies. Pathano skates through, goes for an attempted shot on net, which is redirected by the Bearcats. Peters does a nice step in, tries to go to the slot. Bearcats step up, get it out. Evans picks it back up in the neutral ice, passing over to Peters. Peters over to Pathano. Pathano getting it back into the Bearcats zone. 
Bearcats backdoor, and a nice save by the goalie with an attempted backdoor shot there by Walney. Katana, again, bouncing puck up in the slot. Peter stepping up. And the Bearcats able to skate it out, getting out of the zone. Nice hit there by Evans. We see the Bearcats player down on the ice after a quick whistle after the hit by Evans. See number 38 holding his head there. Took, looks like he may have hit the boards funny, but he is back on his feet, skating over to the bench. He got 11.26 here remaining in the third period. Huskies down one to four. If you are near, if you're just tuning in, encourage you guys to come on out tomorrow to support the Huskies in person at about five o'clock p.m. Central Time. We're doing a skate with the skis after the game, directly after the game. We got a bunch of rental skates here lined up for you guys. So come on out, join the skis, bring the kids, parents, and grandparents. Huskies come out on top after the faceoff. Who's down in Porzondak's possession. Wall holds it in the corner down in the Husky zone. Puts it up to Bearcats possession. Nice skate through by Gonzalez. Getting it, redirecting the puck away from the net. 17 gets that up on the point, pass it over to 61. 61 goes deep into the Husky zone, into the corner. Three steps up, goes for a quick shot on Vucci, and a nice save, and Marks. Flips it up into neutral ice, pass over to Wall. Nice pass to Wall. Wall goes for a quick shot, and a nice save by Dallier. A lot of back and forth here after behind the net. Loose puck in front of the net. A little bit of scrum here again, fighting out. and a blow of the whistle after a nice, another save by Dallier. Both teams getting some fresh legs out here with 10.44 remaining in the third period. Martin taking the face off against Bracker. Quick attempted one-timer there by Evans. Unfortunately incomplete, quick step up there by Evans. Putting down in Bearcats possession, goes for a quick shot and a nice save by Vucci. Putting into the net above the glass for a quick out of play whistle. Again, puck's gonna be dropped back down in the Husky zone. Martin taking the face off against Brocker. Huskies win the face off. Puts it down into Evans' possession, passing it through neutral ice. And again, number 55 dropping a stick on the ice and another whistle for an icing. And it's about the fifth or sixth stick I saw flying or going drop out of the Bearcats' hands today so far. We got Peters talking to the refs trying to figure out something that happened there. Seems to be some sort of disagreeance. And Martin taking the face off against Smith. Quick whistle immediately after the puck was dropped. Bearcats come out on top with the puck. 55 up in the point, passing it down, getting the puck right back. Over to 77. 77 goes for a quick shot and nice save by Vucci. A lot of back and forth here between the two teams. Takes a weird bounce, gets stuck in the back of the net. Again, getting knocked back down into the corner. 29 goes for another quick shot, another quick save by Vucci. 77 steps up, shot barely missing the net to the back left. Causing the puck to be rung around and out of the Husky zone. At 29 over to 77, passes over. Patana, nice knock out of the air. Bearcats pick it right back up. And a far off sides on number 71 for the Bearcats. Again, a lot of back and forth here. No clear possession between the two teams. Gets a little sloppy down in the corner. Gets the puck being dropped right outside the blue line here. Pathana taking the face off against Alexandrov. Alexandrov wins the face off and gets it down deep into the Husky zone. Puck gets rung around over to Walney. Walney chips it up to Pathana. Pathana through the neutral ice. 
takes it into the Bearcats zone. He drops it back over to Clement. A lot of back and forth here, shot on net, nice save by Dalier. Again, Bearcats come out on top with the puck, passing behind the net. In the corner, goes off the boards. Tent to pass through neutral lights, Pathana picks it off, gets it down deep back into the Bearcats corner. Two on two coming out here, we got 23 and 49 for the Bearcats. 49 goes for a quick shot. A nice redirect there by Marks. Marks is down on the ice, picks up the puck on the hash marks and puts it up the boards. After a nice shot block there, got a little bit of a limp, but he's jumping right back up. 23 skates in the zone, quick shot on, barely missing the net to the left. 49 again goes for a shot, stopped by Porzondek. Porzondek passes it up to after. 61 picks it off and gets it down deep into the Husky zone. Bucci steps up, passes it over to Evans. Evans up to Wall. Wall skates it into the Bearcats zone. Passes it behind his back, and 38 picked off the pass for Bearcats. Change in the direction. Puck gets dumped down back deep into the Husky zone by the Bearcats. Of course, Ondak picked it up in the corner. Backhand pass, trying to get it out of the zone. Gonzalez, fine for it on the boards, and Wall comes out on top. Wall backhand pass over to After. After goes through the feet of 71, 77. Dodges 17's hit. Passes it over to Wall. Goes for an attempt to pass over to Evans. Martin comes in, picks up the puck, brings it down in the corner as he receives some pressure from the Bearcats. Rizuko trying to keep it in, barely missing the net. Still got it delayed off sides. Got a whistle against Martin. Martin didn't realize it was still delayed off sides. Put off. Martin taking the face off against Smith. Bearcats come out on top from the face off. Sorry, Huskies come out on top from the face off. Evans brings it behind the net, goes off the boards over to Gieski. Gieski through Zuko. Zuko skates it up, passes it through neutralized over to Peters. Peters back door and a barely missed shot causing the puck to go behind the net. 39 skates it out. We got a one on two here. He has number three and Evans skating out. Got a little bit of back and forth here, holding each other. We got Evans and Davenport going to the boxes. Looked like we had Davenport holding Evans there as Evans tried to skate away, grabbed a stick. We saw Evans with a little bit of retaliation on that. Got seven minutes and nine seconds remaining in the third period. He's trying to figure out who they're putting out. We got Alexandrov taking the face off against Gonzalez. Huskies win the face off. Go, Mark shows for chip off the board, hitting it into the Husky bench, causing a quick another out of play whistle. Gonzalez again taking the face off against Alexandrov. Alexandrov wins the face off back to number eight for the Bearcats. Eight over to 55. Pass over to 49, Alexandrov. Alexandrov skates it in. That's 22, 22 with a quick shot, and nice save by Vucci. Marks comes out on top of the puck. Starts getting some speed behind him. Oster, a funny pass, goes over to 55 possession. Goes for a shot, and a goal on Vucci. Making this a one to five game for Bearcats being up. Both teams getting some fresh legs out after the Bearcats goal there. Lining up a center ice, we got Pathana taking the face off against Brackert. Brackert wins the face off, putting it back into Bearcats possession. 
They begin to skate it through center ice. Getting it into the Husky zone, bring it into the corner. 25 again comes out on top, passing it back down deep into the Husky zone. Anderson putting some pressure down in the corner, trying to win that puck. Got a lot of back and forth here, gets pinned on the boards, no clear possession between the two teams. Bearcats come out on top. 55, 25, passes it down to 39, gets the puck right back up on the blue line, goes for a quick shot right into Bucci's glove for another quick whistle. Got 47 seconds remaining on both Evans and Davenport penalties. And we still got some four and four hockey here between the two teams. Peters pass it up to Rizuko. Rizuko skates it in to the Bearcats zone. Bearcats again begin their breakout. 49 holding it down low, top of the circles. And Martin with a great step up there, knocking off a, a stick, but Bearcats again quickly regain possession. Skating it down, goes for a quick shot. And a nice save there by Anderson, not letting it get to the net. Anderson passes it over. Rizuko. Rizuko goes for an attempted shot on net, blocked by the Bearcats. Martin gets it up on the point. Martin over to Porzondek. One timer and a nice save by Dalier. And it is even play again. Both guys are out of the penalty box. It's back to five on five hockey. Davenport comes out of the box flying, gets the puck down, goes for an attempted pass in the slot. 55 comes in, catches the puck out of air. Pat Puts it down to his own stick. Getting Davenport over to 23. Evans comes through with a nice hit, not letting him get a shot off. Again, 55. Tries to hold the puck, falls after a nice hit by Evans. And a nice save there by Vucci. I don't even know if he saw that puck. Bounced perfectly off of his pad. 49 goes for a quick shot, another save by Vucci. March puts it off the glass. Up to Rizuko, Rizuko off the board, skiing it out of the Husky zone. Voida goes get it deep in the Husky zone, stopped by Gonzalez. March over to Porzondak and right back out of the Husky zone. Quick chip, chip in there, Porzondak picking up the puck. Again, you see a quick whistle there by the Raf after Voida. Punched Gonzalez in the head, but it seems like it was a bit of retaliation putting both Gonzalez and Voida in the box. Again, making this another penalty for each team as there's four minutes and three seconds remaining in the third period. After taking the face off, and Bearcats come out on top. 14. Pass it through neutral ice, we're to 81, 81, drop back to 25. Goes for a quick shot, and a nice redirect there by Evans, putting it into the net above the glass. Causing another out of play whistle. <laughs> 81 taking the face off against after again. Coming out on top of the puck, quick shot on Vucci, putting it through his five hole, making this a one to six game for the Bearcats. See a couple of fresh legs jumping out for the Huskies. We got Colwell sitting on wing with Pierce taking the face off. And then we got Marks and Porzondak back on D. It is back to four and four hockey again after that penalty on Gonzalez and Voida. Huskies on top in possession. Cowell gets the puck up in the neutral zone, attempt to pass over to March. This puck gets knocked down deep in the Bearcats zone. Again, Bearcats hold it behind the net, set up for their breakout. 77 over to 61. Puck goes up in the air. 
And a quick shot on Vucci, barely missing the net to the right. Calls from the puck again to bounce out of the Husky zone. Goalie jumps down in the corner to make a play. A nice pass up to Porzondek. Porzondek steps in, goes for a quick shot. An attempted shot over by Pierce, but a nice stop there by the Bearcats. Porzondek gets the puck again, and puts it down deep into the Bearcats zone. Italiano again fighting for it in the corner. Again, Porzondek picks it up, passes it off the boards himself, carries it into the Bearcats zone, goes for a quick shot. And a nice redirect by number eight, knocking into the net above the glass, causing another out of play whistle. Both leg, both teams getting some fresh legs. You got Martin taking the face off against Portel. Bearcats come out on top. The puck. Nice stop there by Evans. Bearcats again pick up the puck. Got a two on two right breaking out here. Puck goes back to number 25. 25 over to 14, 14 attempted shot, whiffing it. And Gieske on his knees, able to get it out of the zone. Martin passing over to Evans. Evans carries it in. Goes for a quick backhanded shot on the goalie. Going right into his glove for another stoppage play. Back to five on five hockey here. The whistle just as both Times got knocked off the clock. We've got two minutes and one second remaining here in the third period. Martin taking the face off. Huskies come out on top. Nice chip there by number three, Davenport. Getting out of the Husky zone. Puck goes down into the Huskies in the corner. Again, hitting the net above the glass for an unlucky Bounce caused him to be another out of play whistle. Minute 50 remaining here with the Huskies down, one to six. Martin takes the face off. Goes for a quick another shot in Vucci's glove with another very quick whistle, only knocking four seconds off the clock. Martin still taking the face off. Drop of the puck and Huskies come out on top with the puck. A nice step up there by Bry. Nice redirect to the pass. They're getting it out of the Husky zone. Nice step up there by Pierce, knocking it off a 39 stick, getting it down deep into the Bearcat zone. 55, Voider again begins his skate up. Five goes for a quick shot. Nice redirect by Anderson, not letting a shot go on net. Bry holds it down the corner, puts it up to point. Voider goes for a quick another shot, missing the net high and to the left. Number eight gets it up on the point, goes for a quick shot right into Vucci's glove, causing for another whistle with a minute and six seconds remaining left in the third period. Again, we got the Bearcats change in here, getting some fresh legs. We've got Black Eyed Peas playing on the radio. Pierce taking the face off against number 81. Quick shot on Vucci for another quick whistle. This last bit here seems to be a lot of quick whistles. Nothing more than 20 seconds going by before another whistle goes off. Pierce again taking the face off against Brackert. Bearcats with another attempted shot. It's a loose puck in front of the net. We got a minute left here in the third period. Colwell skates it up, picks it up, skating it into the Bearcats zone. Gets it deep into the corner. Bearcats gain possession. Go for an attempted pass, missed. Putting it down deep into the Huskies zone. Had Anderson slide funny into the boards there, full speed. It's getting right back up. Luckily, nothing came out of that. That's always dangerous when you go sliding into the boards like that. Anderson catches it in front of the net. Putting it off the boards over to Mataliano, who gets it out of the Husky zone. Again, Bearcats back in possession. And a offsides whistle on 21 for the Bearcats. Mm -hmm. 
Again, a lot of back and forth here. We got 13.4 seconds remaining in the third period. Huskies just got to finish off strong here. Come back tomorrow. Cole Wall skates it into the Bearcat zone. Puck gets turned over. Nice step up there by Anderson, directing it around as the last couple seconds count down on the clock. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the final buzzer. End of the third period. Huskies lost one to six. Thank you all for tuning in today. And if you're not able to come in person, I encourage you guys to again tune in. We are playing at five o'clock tomorrow. Game time starts. And if you're near or want to come out and support us in person, we are doing a after skate with the team. I encourage you guys to come out, skate with the team, bring the kids, the adults and the grandparents. We've got rental skates here for you guys. And ladies and gentlemen, that is all we have for you tonight. Thank you again for tuning in, and we'll see you again tomorrow.